Our Malaysian plant workers are suing Kimberly Clark after alleged abuse at one of the company's suppliers overseas. New at 4, our Emily Byer breaks down the allegations in that complaint. Emily. Cami, these are federal charges alleging forced labor at a plant in Malaysia. The documents show the 13 plaintiffs are all citizens of Bangladesh and worked in Malaysia for Brightway Group, a key supplier for Kimberly Clark Corporation. The plaintiffs refer to themselves as the former forced laborers. In the documents, they claim they had to work 12 plus hour days, often with restricted access to food, water, and bathrooms. They say they were physically and or verbally abused, and they didn't get paid or it was in complete compensation. Their passports were also seized by Brightway. They're bringing their claims to the U.S. because there is no law in Bangladesh where the plaintiffs can seek civil damages for injuries. Each of the plaintiffs is asking for more than $75,000, but it doesn't disclose a specific amount. The documents also allege that Kimberly Clark knew they were benefiting from forced labor. That was Emily Byer reporting. In a statement from Kimberly Clark received just about an hour ago, the company says it filed a motion to dismiss this case earlier this year. Quoting now, we believe the allegations raised in the Brightway Group lawsuit filed in August of 2022 are unfounded and have sought the dismissal of the lawsuit. It's important to know that this facility in Malaysia is not operated by Kimberly Clark and we stopped working with Brightway in 2021. End quote.